Hi friends, most of you watch my channel without subscribing. Please subscribe if you like my stories. Have a good rest. In today's episode, we delve into a story of betrayal, its repercussions, and the steep price woman paid for her affair. It was a sunny morning in Lakeside as Liam poured his morning coffee. He took a sip and sighed contentedly, ready to start his day. As a finance manager at Coleman Incorporated, Liam always had a full schedule, but he didn't mind. He found his job engaging, and he was proud of his reputation as a savvy money manager. Liam's wife Sophia was rushing around the kitchen, gathering her things for work. She gave Liam a quick kiss goodbye before hurrying out the door. Sophia worked as a marketing director for Denton Enterprises across town. Between their two busy careers, life was hectic but financially comfortable for the couple. Liam and Sophia came from traditional Christian families and grew up in Lakeside's affluent suburbs. They met at church as teenagers and soon became high school sweethearts. After college, they married and settled down in Lakeside to start their professional lives. Now in their early 30s, they were established in their careers. Lion had made some shrewd investments that paid off handsomely, bringing him significant wealth over the years. Sophia also commanded a high salary at her marketing job. But Liam noticed Sophia seemed to have very expensive tastes, always buying new designer clothes, handbags, shoes and jewellery. She loved treating herself to luxury items and tending to her appearance. Liam didn't mind her spending money on herself, but wished she was more prudent with her salary. Still, Liam couldn't complain too much. Especially with the generous inheritance Sophia was set to receive from her parents one day. Overall, they were financially set for the future. Liam arrived home one evening to find the house in disarray. The furniture was pushed haphazardly to the walls and tarps covered the floors. We're renovating the house. Sophia announced excitedly. I hired a contractor while you were at work. Isn't it wonderful? Liam was surprised Sophia had made such a big decision without consulting him. But he wanted her to be happy. That's great, honey, he said supportively. This old place could use some freshening up. The 1950s split-level house had been Liam's childhood home. After his parents passed away, he and Sophia moved into it. The decor was outdated but full of memories. Over the next few weeks, Liam watched his childhood home transform. The contractor updated the kitchen and bathrooms. He repainted the walls in trendy colors and installed new light fixtures throughout. One day, the contractor asked Liam if he wanted a security system added. Cameras could be installed outside to monitor the doors and perimeter. Lion thought this sounded like a good idea. As long as the cameras only faced outward and ensured their privacy inside, he was on board. The security package also came with handy features like smartphone access, motion detection alerts, and 30 days of secure cloud storage. Lime made sure Sophia knew about the cameras going in. He didn't mention the other high-tech features, assuming she wouldn't be interested. With the house in disarray from the renovations, Liam and Sophia took a break for a few weeks to finalize design plans. One afternoon while Sophia was at work, curiosity struck Liam. He decided to check out the new security system. He logged into the app on his phone, surprised to see live footage from multiple cameras pop up. Liam scrolled through the different views, getting familiar with the setup. He tapped to view the front door camera. With a jolt of surprise, he noticed a shiny BMW parked out front. Whose car was that? Sophia was supposed to be at the office right now. Liam felt a prickle of suspicion. He pulled up Sophia's contact and called her. Hey hon, what's up? She answered casually, too casually. Just checking in to say hi, Liam said lightly. How's your day going? Oh fine, you know how busy it gets here, she replied. Was there something you needed? No, nothing urgent, said Liam. I'll let you get back to work. Love you. You too, Sophia said quickly. Liam hung up, mind racing. Why had Sophia lied about being at the office? He stared at the shiny BMW, still parked outside his home. Something was very wrong here. Liam kept watching the live feed with growing anger and dismay. About 40 minutes later, he saw the front door open. A tall, well-dressed man 
walked out holding Sophia in his arms. The kiss passionately by the BMW. Liam felt like he'd been punched. Sophia was cheating on him. Rage surged through Liam's body. But strangely, beneath the anger, he felt an eerie calm. A practical detachment descended over him. His analytical mind began calculating how to best protect himself. Lion left work early that day, telling his boss he had a migraine. He checked into a hotel under an assumed name and contemplated his next steps. He had a prenuptial agreement with Sophia that ensured equal distribution of assets if they divorced. But Lion had built up significant savings and the divorce would still be costly if Sophia took her half under the prenup. Lion refused to bankroll her betrayal. No, he would not make this easy for Sophia. Lion was not a vindictive man by nature, but he was patient and relentless when someone crossed him. Sophia would pay for her sins. Lion met discreetly with a divorce lawyer recommended by a trusted friend. Together, they devised a plan to leave Sophia with nothing. Over the next few months, Liam bided his time gathering evidence. He installed hidden cameras throughout the house, capturing video of Sophia's continued trysts. Lion learned the man was a board member at her company. He kept his rage suppressed and life proceeded normally while Liam set his trap. After four agonizing months, he was ready to confront Sophia with irrefutable proof of her lies and deceit. It was the 4th of July. Liam and Sophia were hosting a big family barbecue at their newly renovated home. Both of their parents, siblings, aunts, uncles, and cousins would be there. Lion waited until everyone had arrived and was mainly in the backyard. He called for their attention, then had a courier hand Sophia a manila envelope. Sophia looked bewildered as she opened it up and began reading family members craning their necks to see over her shoulders. These, these are divorce papers, Sophia exclaimed. Have you lost your mind? Lime's mother gasped. Liam, what is the meaning of this? Liam held up his hand for silence. You all deserve an explanation for my actions. But first, I think it's only fair we hear Sophia's side of the story. He pulled out a laptop and opened a file of time-stamped photos and videos exposing Sophia's affair over the past four months. The family watched in stunned silence as the evidence played out before them. Sophia's face turned bright red. She tried to stammer excuses, but no one was listening. Groans and shouts of outrage erupted from the crowd. Liam's parents glared accusingly at a wilting Sophia. Her own mother and father looked disgusted, refusing to meet their daughter's eyes. Liam calmly closed the laptop. I'll be filing for divorce immediately and contesting any spousal support. My lawyer will be in touch, he told Sophia coldly. Then he walked away without looking back, leaving Sophia to contend with their outraged family on her own. In the ensuing weeks, Sophia desperately tried to make amends. She called Liam weeping, begging his forgiveness. She blamed the other man entirely, claiming Liam was the only one she truly loved. But Liam did not waver or soften. Their marriage was irrevocably broken, the roots of trust rotten. At their OC mediation session, Sophia realized her pleadings were futile. Her demeanor shifted to haughty indignation. I'll be taking half of everything you own, she declared spitefully, and I'll find another man to treat me how I deserve. Liam kept his expression impassive, but internally her words lit a fire in him. She would not get one cent of his money if he had anything to do with it. The day of their court hearing arrived. Sophia sat at the defendant's table looking smug, clearly expecting to leave with a substantial settlement. Liam watched in satisfaction as Sophia's smile faded and her face paled. She was informed that Liam had transferred all marital assets out of his name weeks ago. The house they lived in was his before the marriage, also untouchable. Liam had only kept a few months' living expenses in his bank account, enough to show income preceding the divorce filing. Sophia's lawyer rifled through the paperwork frantically trying to find assets to seize. But Liam's financial records were meticulously clean. Tepper boy, Sophia hissed at Liam when she realized it was hopeless. The judge finalized the divorce, granting Sophia nothing. Liam's trap had worked flawlessly. 
Liam decided it was time to set his plan into motion to ruin Sophia's reputation and career. He contacted the HR department at her company with an anonymous tip. Then he sent irrefutable evidence by courier exposing Sophia's affair with the board member. Days later, Liam received word that Sophia and her lover had both been terminated. Sophia would never be getting a reference from Denton Enterprises again. Liam made sure the sordid story circulated quickly through Lakeside's marketing circles. Sophia was now branded as an unfaithful liar. No reputable company would hire her. Eventually, she was forced to take a low-level telemarketing job just to make ends meet. Liam relished imagining her misery as she faced a life of scraping by on a meager salary. Sophia soon had to sell off her beloved designer clothes and shoes just to afford her basic expenses month to month. She was utterly destroyed, left with nothing both financially and socially. Liam stayed with a friend briefly until he could sell the house and move on. He took a long vacation to celebrate his new freedom. He did some consulting work before accepting a lucrative position at a competing firm. These days, he was dating a kind down-to-earth woman he met through mutual friends. Liam's betrayal by Sophia would stay with him forever. But he was relieved to be starting a new chapter, leaving his deceitful ex-wife firmly in the past where she belonged. Music